Here in Glasgow, <laughs> just leave the train. It's so up sky to me that's not like a queen to go. <laughs> yeah. It is the how that I am staying. It's lazy stay up sky. It's lazy. It's lazy how. Yeah. I never think that I go into use a selfie stick till today. <laughs> already full like I think it's like 4 45 so it's like five minutes This is the morning of 6th September and I'm going to show you five so we are still Ahead. 
beautiful dream the other day I was in a house overlooking a tropical bay Sunlight streaming through the walls of glass White sandy beaches, green palm trees and grass Ocean such a bright clear shade of blue I was smiling as my eyes Big one. Yeah, super big. Easy to recognize.
last guy and then we're going to take off from Gas Girl and then from Gas Girl we're going to take another bus uh, I'm, I'm really bad at have a time to change for him to go here but I don't know why his island is here I don't know why I'm going to have a time to change for him to go here I don't know why I'm going to have a Because like I take a bus of ACL Sky yesterday the whole night and I arrive at Edinburgh at midnight. So I book this hotel to stay just for one night. So and I going to move to another hotel now. <laughs> yeah. Because like um at first I going to book just only that one but because like I came with Lolly Let so I can't I can't stay there like I have to spend the time from midnight to 11 o'clock nowhere so she said that I should book this hotel for another night so I don't have to stay at McDonald's for the whole night you know yeah this this room is quite good it's a share room that you see I don't really see any girls because like I came really late so everyone already sleeping <laughs> but yeah I think the room is quite nice I like it yeah that is so from now I'm going to spend the day just only one day and a half here in Edinburgh but I don't really have any plan yet but they said that it's half a festival here in Edinburgh so I might go to visit some place around there yeah yeah I think it's literally I feel really weird because like I go into back home now it's like I have just only three days I guess from today to spend on Edinburgh and tomorrow to take to back to London and then another day to back home completely so I feel really weird like everything is seriously forced
guys, this is the Roomba guys day for the night here in Edinburgh. I got it from Airbnb. Okay, so let me kill this. It's a small one, but really convenient. And the horse is really cute. Yeah, so from now I'm going to to take a train back to London. But I, I still have time for like three or four hours to spend that more time in Edinburgh. Yeah, and they're going to take the train for maybe four hours to London, Western. I don't know if it's called Western or Western, but anyway, yeah. This is my bag. Yeah, I have one backpack. It is really heavy. The record that I got from here, I feel I see a really good record shop. Yeah, so I bought some and some shopping stuff and another bag. Yeah, I have like a lot of things. <laughs> yeah, but I, I like I can't stop shopping. It's like I think that in Edinburgh the house does a lot of things, and I really like the top some traditional stuff. So I bought some and I can't stand with the green record so yeah I have a lot of things yeah it's a little heavy I don't have like a suitcase or plus get you know so yeah Um, if you watched it until this, I have to say thank you so much for watching this video. I know that this video is quite long and of course it is the longest video that I have ever made as well. So I don't know what you guys think about it. But um, I have to say that this video is mean so much to me. Like you see that my hair is not pink anymore. And I have cut it already and my back hair is growing up. It means that today is 25 December. It means that I back from London for 5 months already. I know that is quite long but seriously after I back from London I doesn't have any time at all because I've been busy like every day. So I doesn't have a time to finish the video and of course to record this. So, yeah, like I said that this video is really mean so much to me, so I want to do it nice and yeah. If you have followed me on Instagram for a long time, you're going to know that I am a big fan of Lee the McQueen. I thought about him a lot and I post a lot of illustration of his work because I am a big fan and he mean like a lot to me. Um, Sometimes I feel like he is a god or maybe a father and you know he is a genius and 
I have a chance to know him when I was in the middle school, I think it's 2010 when he had passed away already. So, and you know that I'm quite young, <laughs> I'm just 21, so it means that I never have a chance to meet him in person. Yeah, so sad. But anyway, so after I have known him, he was inspired me in many ways like art, design, fashion, and I love the way that he have a passion for his work and stuff, so I always dream to be like him. I always dream that one day I going to meet him. Of course, not in person because he passed away already, so maybe it's just to go to meet him in his graveyard. I think it's the closest thing that possible to me. So I have dream it like seven years or ten years to leave that pet to leave that pest. But I never have a chance until now. Um this time I went to study tailoring course. Is it a short course program in London College of Fashion? So I go into so I spend a month in London alone. So I think this is the good opportunity to meet him. Yeah. Because like at at first I think that I'm not going to go there because it's quite hard. Seriously to even you are in London to go in Isle of Sky it's quite hard. <laughs> Seriously. Because it's quite far away from London. Yeah, let let me tell about it. This, this is like a really topic of this talk, I have to say it, <laughs> because it's, it's a really hard work, so let me say it about that. Um, at first I have to say that I spent a lot of time with transportation to Isle of Sky. At first, uh, I think because like Scotland and London are quite close, it, it's a 4 hour by chance, so I think that it's easy, yeah, but I think it's long. <laughs> yeah, at first I I spent four hours in the train from London Houston to um, Glasgow. Yeah, I yeah, it's, it's just only four hours. Yeah, and then I have to take a bus from Glasgow to East of Sky because it doesn't have a train or a bad hand. <laughs> so I have to take just only a bus, and the bus is. Seven hour, yeah. So, I I went to Glasgow. I arrived there at um, ten o'clock, I guess. I checked the bus from Glasgow to Isle of Sky for seven hour, and then from from Isle of Sky because that I have booked um, the hotel in quite late. Um, because a lot of stuff so I booked it in a few days before I went to Easter of Sky so all the hotel in the Iceland are full so I have to stay so I decided to go to the closest pair to Easter of Sky it is the Lasse so I stay in Lasse Hall which is 20 minutes from Easter of Sky by Philly it is quite nice. <laughs> so yeah, that is what it looks like. And then, because his graveyard is in the north -est of Isle of Sky, so it means that I have to took a car from the ferry area to his graveyard for one hour. Yeah. So imagine that I still have to take a took the car back, took the ferry back, took the bus back, and took the train back to London. So it means that I have spent like more than 24 hours in transportation. Yep. The Isle of Sky trip that you have seen, it took me a week. I think it's like 5 or 6 days, which is quite long. At first I... I think that I might not go there anymore because it's really hot and for because like I seriously like you know that I am 
I born in Thailand and I living in Bangkok. I seriously I spent all my life in Bangkok in the heart of the city. Like so I never live in the place that it doesn't have a taxi or a chat before. Yeah. Even a bus I don't really use to with it because like I said, I bought in a really part of the country. <laughs> yeah. So to go to Isle of Sky is quite challenging me because I scared that I might going to get lost there and something like that. Even I leave London already. All my friends said that. Are you sure that you're going to Isle of Sky alone? It is not that easy for girls alone, especially that you in lead is not that cute. So I, I get scared a lot, and I think that I might not going there. Because like, and also that, like I said, that uh, I have been to meet him for ten years. It it mean a lot. It's a long time. So I I feel weird if I achieve it. What is next? Something like that. So I yeah, I I almost gave up. But anyway, like you see, I have lived it already and. I never regret about it. It's a wonderful town. That I think is the best thing that I I ever did to my life. To know more people in London, to study there, to have a friend there, to meet a s t e m as queen, to go to East of Sky. I have to say that it's a really beautiful place that I have ever seen, and I still wish to visit it again. Yeah. So, so thank you so much for you guys who watching this video. Like I have mentioned it before that this video is really mean so much to me. So I would like to see some response from you guys if possible. Maybe you can comment down below to let me know what you guys think about this video. Um. So I can know if it's good or bad, and maybe you can just say hi to me. And please click subscribe to my channel so you're not going to miss the next video that going to pop up soon. I can say that I going to pop up next video is really little soon about my work, my lifestyle, and daily work of fashion student life. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And and if you guys really like this video, I hope that you guys going to share this video for your friends. Maybe a friend that have a passion in fashion design, or a friend that want to be a fashion designer, or a friend that have that was love or is no McQueen, just the same way as me. So hopefully this video going to able to inspire you guys to meet new people as for. The new path that you have never been, or do the thing that you already evolved but never have a chance to do it or get scared to do it. This is the end of today now. Thank you so much and very much, you guys. See you soon.